Well, this is Mike Caps. I'm here with Toys Nation, and we're having the craziest <laughs> Gears launch. I wish you could be here. All right, now we just had a real great panel with IGDA on what it takes to get into the gaming industry. So how did you get into the game? I took the craziest path. I, I started as a professor, got my PhD in, in virtual reality, and then uh, did a game for the art. That's how I met the peeps at Epic and got into uh, And um, watching some of the gameplay, watching the realism, looking and comparing that to Unreal 3, I've seen that you guys have actually gone back and actually tweaked and improved upon the industry standard engine, if Thanks. I would say. <laughs> Thanks very much. Yeah, I mean, we've had a lot of success. Uh, we're known for great graphics and great art, but we couldn't just do Gears 1.5. You know, that would that would upset our fans, and we wouldn't be proud of it. So I think we really we really pushed it hard. It's not just a few more hours. It's all new systems, all new multiplayer. Uh, I think we knocked it out of the park. I'm really proud of it. The tech is one of those things that's incredibly versatile. It's uh, it's basically a paint and a brush and a canvas, and you can make whatever you want with it. I mean, we have Shadow Complex, which uh, takes that classic to gameplay and puts it 3D World, you had uh, X-Men Origins, Wolverine, uh, the Splinter Cell games, I mean all these games that really leverage the technology in all sorts of different ways and uh, we want to do what we can, not only as a business <laughs> model, but also to help facilitate developers' visions by providing better tools because we're in a world where making a game is extremely expensive, it takes a lot of people to make a game and any way you can mitigate that risk is a good thing, that's what we provide for the tools and not. So actually talk about the story though. Uh -huh. Oh, well, you know, it, it's a it's a popcorn movie, right? And we wanted to be an action thriller. It's Terminator. It's Die Hard. Uh, but Die Hard had a love story. You know, McLean's wife is there, and he's worried about her. And we wanted some more of that feeling of, you know, Dom's searching for his wife. He might have lost her in an emergency. He's looking for her everywhere. You see in the commercial, he's got the head yeah. Exactly. I was about to mention that. And he's exactly. looking at that, and it's. It's touching, so go ahead. Thanks. And, you know, and I saw a reviewer play our game through. These are the most jaded guys that you can find in the industry. They play every game. I saw a little tear come down his cheek when he was watching one of our cinematics. He's like, I win. That's what I want. I want to make even those guys feel a little bit of emotion. And then go back to blowing shit up like we do, you know? Of course.